Sean Hogg was 17 years old when he raped and sexually assaulted a 13-year-old girl in a public place. Four years passed until he was eventually convicted of his crimes, so he is now 21. The judge who sentenced him had to sentence him as if he were 17 years old. They're the rules. And the judge also had to abide by sentencing rules laid down by the Scottish Sentencing Council. However, the sentence of 270 hours of community work is, in my opinion, way too lenient. Sentencing is supposed to include an element of deterrence, not only for the offender, but for people who read and listen and see about the case. I don't think a community sentence acts as any deterrent in this case, and there should be that element, because we all know the appallingly low conviction rate for rape and other offences. Handing out an unduly lenient sentence like this is not going to convince victims of other crimes to come forward. That is what I fear. And to repeat, I think the sentence in this case was inappropriate and way, way too lenient. I hope that the prosecuting authorities will ask for this sentencing to be reviewed. I think it is right in certain circumstances that a person's tender years should be taken into account when they commit crime. For example, I wouldn't want to see a young teenager sentenced to a very, very punitive amount of time in jail for a minor crime. But we're talking about rape in this instance and sexual assault. Very serious crimes. Very serious crimes should attract a suitable punishment. The judge said that prison might not contribute to Sean Hogg's rehabilitation. However, if he spends 270 hours picking up litter, for example, I'm not sure that litter picking might necessarily deter him from offending again. That would be my concern. I think in this case, where there is widespread public concern about violence against women and girls, the judge has simply got it wrong, in my opinion. I hope this case is reviewed, and I hope that a more appropriate punishment can be handed down in the future.